Okay, ladies and gentlemen, let us have a little bit of an extension of understanding the premium plan, understanding the matrix of the premium plan. I want to use this opportunity to do a little bit of an experiment um, from one of my accounts. So let's use one of my account to do an experiment. Okay, now I just log in into one of these my accounts and then um, because we are going to the matrix now this account has eight direct referrals and a global team of 7969 now let's quickly go to the matrix to go to the matrix you come to account and then you scroll down you see matrix you click on the matrix now we should always visit our matrix as often as possible. Now, I would like to bold in it so that I zoom it out. I would like to zoom it as loud as possible. Okay, um, this is loud enough. And I believe that everybody can see this picture very clearly. All right, everybody can see this picture very clearly. Now, what am I trying to show us here? I'm trying to show us how the growth of Club 250 Cent is and how it works. And let us um, um, experiment or compare it with our personal experience with our back office. The username of this particular account is Austin Billion 3. Now, Austin Billion 3 is in level two. Okay, the number you see in bracket is your number, is your level in the matrix. Now, this account has um, one account on the left, uh, Ujim C. Ujim C is in level two. Happiness, level, level two. Now, right immediately after these two accounts is four accounts arranged under these two. Now, you guys will see the reason why you need to watch this video to the end. Now, right under Ujim C3, which is in level two, is Mirabel. Mirabel. Mirabel is in level two. Then Prince Wealth One is level two. Then Hero Chief is in level three. It means that Hero Chief has overtaken Austin Billion three. All right. Overtaking is allowed. Now, under happiness, um, Hero Chief has overtaken happiness 03 and has also overtaken uh, Austin Billion 3. Now, at the extreme here, you, you find Justin 8080 is in level one. So, what are we, um, from the analysis we have here, we can conclude perfectly well by saying that Austin Billion three was supposed to be in level three, but he's still in level three because Justin, Justin 8080 is in level one. So this is the person holding Austin Billion, Austin Billion three. Now, if I am busy working with Mirabel, working with Prince World, working with Hero Shift, no matter how much I work with these people, I will continue to be in level two. All of them will come and and then pass me by. Okay, my career will just be at level two because for some reasons I am not able to check my legs to know where I should focus more of my energy at any given point in time. Ladies and gentlemen, at this material time, the person I should be working with much more, or I should be more concerned about is Justin 8080, so I could move to level three. It, it just made sense that I have to work with Justin 8080, otherwise all these persons will overtake me. And when they overtake me, it will amount to miss profit or lose profit. So I will be losing money I'm ought, I ought to make from Ujim C, Happiness, Mirabel, Prince Wealth, and the Hero Shift just because i was careless i didn't take notice or i didn't take note of what is happening to justin 8080 
So what can I do to make Justin 8018 get to level two so I could go to level three? Let's see on this video if our experiment on our analysis will serve us right. So in a situation like this, it's either that I call on Justin or I look for a way to call on happiness to work with Justin so that I can move to level three, or I will just go to my account and create one more account. If I create one more account from this analysis, remember we said in our earlier video that this um, matrix arranges or it moves from left to right, left to right. So it moves from one, two, three, four. Now that this person is level two, this person is level two, this person is level three, hopefully any registration I would do will come to Justin, Justin 8080. Now also note that when an account is in level one, it means that that account either does not have any downline at all or has at least one downline. So to confirm what we're saying, so let's click on Justin 8018 to open up his own matrix for us to see what is inside of Justin, Justin 8018. I've clicked it. Now, Justin 8018 has opened. As you can see, Justin 8018 has one downline. So this downline is what is holding Justin 8018. So what am I going to do? I am going to create one account or activate an existing account under my, under my direct downline with the hope that if that account is upgraded to premium, it will fall down here under Justin 8018 as a spillover. So stay with me as I go back to my referral and activate just one account and see if, if the result we are hoping to have him fall under Justin 8018 as a spillover if it will work. So guys, let's go right away. So what will I do? I will come to the menu, then scroll down to referral. Let me click on referral. So now, these are my referrals, okay? I, I have Austin Billion 20, Austin Billion 17, Austin Billion 12, Austin Billion 11 under this account. So let me look at any of the, any of my accounts. Okay, I have, um, now as you can see here, Austin Billion 20 is in classic. Austin Billion 7 is in, 17 is in classic. Austin Billion 12 is also in classic. And Austin Billion 11 is also in classic. So what do I do? In this case, I will just need to activate one. I will just have to activate one of these accounts. Let me activate Austin Billion 11. I want to activate Austin Billion 11. So since it's in classic, hopefully, it is supposed to go, um, it's supposed to fall under, now let me log out of this account. I want to log out of Austin Billion 3, and then I think I have some dollars in Austin Billion one. Let me check. Wow. Obviously, I just have um, seven dollar in Austin Billion. Austin Billion one. Okay, um, what will happen is this. 
um, let me fund, let me fund Austin Billion. Let me see how I can fund Austin Billion One. To fund Austin Billion One. Okay, let me do the funding from my phone. So hold on, hold on guys. We're trying to do a very serious experiment here. This is very, very important. Love 250 cents is a career, honestly. And for, for anyone who come in contact with um, Love 250 cents should better take it very seriously because it's indeed a career. I'm trying to, um, on, account one. Of course, you know, the process of funding is to, the process of funding is to click your new top up, new top up. I have done a teaching on that. Um, so if any one of you here does not know how to do the funding, all you need to do is just quickly go to, you just go to your new top up and do the funding there. Just trying to get to it, please let the patients because this, um, this video is very, very important for the experiment I want to do. This video is very, very important. I want you guys to stay tuned to the end of this video. It's very, very important. So we want to experiment and see what will happen to that um, just in 8080 there and move this account from level two to level three. Okay, I have sent phone. So after sending phone, you could just come around and then you click top up, I've sent phone. So I will just click new top up. After new top up, I'll click, I have sent the BNB. So now good. You guys have seen it now, and I have twenty-seven dollars here. Remember, I I actually copied. I actually copied Austin Billion Eleven. So let me send phone. So how do we send phone? To send phone is very simple. You click on the menu, you scroll down to transfer. You click on transfer, then you see new transfer. Then you click new transfer. So let me paste the. Austin Billion 11, as you can see, it's Austin Billion 11, and then I can type 20. I'm sending 20. There's no transaction fee for this. So I'm sending $20. As you can see, the reports now transfer of $20 to Austin Billion 11 succeeded. All right. So now let me log out. Let me log out so I can. We log into Austin Billion three that has that um, username eleven. Okay. Oh no, sorry. I will have to go to Austin Billion eleven. Austin Billion eleven because the phone is sent to Austin Billion eleven. So let me log in into Austin Billion eleven. Now, cool, you have not seen the money. So the next thing to do is upgrade because it's already active in Classic. So the next thing now to do is upgrade. And of course, once I click upgrade, this $20 will move to total withdrawal. 
to join the two dollar fifty cent that is here. So let's go, guys. Cool. Wow. You can see now. So the twenty dollar here has moved to total withdrawal, which is twenty two dollar fifty cent. The total withdrawal simply mean that the deposit I made into my account was landed in account balance, and they have both moved both the two dollar fifty cent that activated classic and the twenty dollar that that has now activated premium. Both have moved to total withdrawal. So now let's see um, our money flow. Let's see our money flow. This is the first time I'm opening money flow. Money flow. Let's see the countdown of the transactions made so far. All right. Um, okay. It's there. So um, let me just quickly, for, for the sake of time, let me quickly go to Austin Billion 3. Now, it is assumed that I have activated an account which hopefully should complete Austin Billion 3 to level 3. So I expect that Austin Billion 3 should now be in level three, no longer two. So let's check it, guys. Okay, so let's go to matrix cool as you can see austin billion three austin B austin billion three is now in level three i hope we have seen it so that is the progress in fact this is this is this is straight away experiment so austin billion three that was in level three has now moved to level three i hope we have seen how the system moves so um with that being said so this brings us to the end of this um record and then with this i hope every one of us have mastered our system um, very, very well. So thank you for watching and see you in my next update. Believing that from, from this video, we have now learned and know how we can master our matrix and work on our matrix. See you guys.